Muscle deprogramming can be confusing and some dentists are unsure when to use it and who to use it for. The purpose of muscle deprogramming is to reduce or relax the muscle activity levels to eliminate muscle pain or tension. What we want to capture and accomplish is that three dimensional position where the muscles are relaxed and the condyles are fully seated in the optimum position. What deprogramming accomplishes by placing something in the anterior to eliminate the posterior occlusal contacts is to allow the lateral pterygoid to relax and release the condyle so that it can fully seat in the fossa. The indications for an anterior plane appliance, also known as a deprogrammer, are as follows. Clencher with a healthy jaw joint, muscle pain or tension, use Lucia jig or leaf gauge to release the lateral pterygoid muscle and seat the condyle fully. Contraindications for this type of appliance are as follows. Joint pain and pain on loading, disc displacement, intracapsular issues, TMD symptoms like ear ringing or ear pain. Anyone who gets worse on leaf cage or Lucia jig, presence of lingual wear on the anterior teeth. The risks for using this appliance on a regular basis includes anterior intrusion or posterior supra eruption with excessive use. When designing the anterior bite plane appliance, scan the patient and capture the bite in maximum intercuspation or using the leaf cage. Then trim the models as this saves your time when designing the appliance later on. When designing the appliance, raise the anterior platform to the opposing, then refine so that only the anterior teeth touch when closing and in lateral movements and then send it for printing. Remember that anterior only contact increases the joint loading if muscle activity doesn't decrease. If you don't get a reduction in the muscle activity, consider an appliance that reduces the joint loading. Stay tuned for part three. Don't forget to save it. Don't forget to share it. Take care.